Hi, I'm James Julian, Product Specialist here at Atlas Copco. In this video, I'll be giving you an overview of the newest functionality to the TBP, Standalone Mode. Standalone will allow you to program up to six P-sets without the use of a power focus controller. Instead, you can use a phone, tablet, or a computer with Wi-Fi to connect to the tool and set it up. All TBP models will now ship in this mode, and out of the box will boot up in standalone. If you plan to use Bluetooth or wireless infrastructure to connect to a power focus, you can set that up from the standalone web GUI or by using Toolstock Service 2 software. Setting up TBP standalone is very simple and can be completed in just a few steps. First, you need to power on the tool with a battery. Then connect to the Wi-Fi SSID broadcast name, which will be TBP underscore and the serial number of the tool you are connecting to. Again, you can do this from a phone, tablet, laptop, basically anything with Wi-Fi and a browser. Once connected to the tool, you can enter the default IP address in a browser and you will then see the main results page. Without logging in, this is the most you can access through the GUI. If there was a PSET selected already, it would run and show the results here. In order to be able to select other PSETs that were already made, you would log in as the operator. That operator login will only allow to switch PSETs and view results. I still need to create some PSETs on here, so I will log in as the manager. Once logged in as the manager, you will have full access to create and run PSETs and some basic tool settings. In the tool settings, you can connect the tool to a power focus via Bluetooth or Wi-Fi, and even enter in the factory network settings. You can also change the reporting units from here and the passwords to connect and log in. Back at the main menu, I can create a PSET. The impulse strategy is configured using the same setting as the power focus 6000, so the options should be familiar. A great new feature to standalone is the ability to test the PSET and see your results in the PSET programming menu. If you need to make any adjustments, simply edit and select test. The PSET will be saved in the tool for you to try the adjustments. You can keep doing this until you are satisfied with the tightening results, then save the PSET and exit the menu. Now I can select the PSET I just created and it takes me to the results screen. The tool now runs and is ready for operation. Live results are shown here, as well as the option to switch PSETs or log out. TBP Standalone is a great alternative to air and clutch tools that also have limited control or reporting. But adding the accuracy of transducerized tightening with a tightening strategy that you can control. This makes the TBP uniquely positioned to be the first step in the transition to Industry 4.0 with the ability to easily connect to a power focus in the future. I hope you found this video helpful. For more information, please contact your local Atlas Copco representative. Thanks for watching.